Here's your inside scoop into exactly how much money you can be making through selling on Amazon FBA whilst working alongside us at Aftermarket Arbitrage. Now these are my favorite type of video to film. This is the second one. So in this video, we're gonna be documenting all of the success that our members have got throughout the month of June, selling on Amazon, and making an extra income. And why is it my favorite? Well, at the end of the day, guys, we get to look and see what our members are doing, how much they're making from just spending 50 quid a month with us, investing in themselves, getting all of our knowledge, resources, expertise, and in return, generating big numbers. So makes me feel good, makes all of our team feel good to see that we are helping people do exactly this, what I'm going to show you right now. Now let's get it started. This is a blinder. So Alex, formerly known in the Discord as Pock, you will have seen him on our social medias if you've watched us before, but we've just dropped a podcast with Alex showing exactly how we started with £500 and then got to a point where he was doing £13,000 of profit in one month. He's put a bit of success in here right now, which you can see. So £5,500 of profit made in June alone. And you can see there, slower month than expected due to American Express putting a limit on my spending. There's some good in this photo as well. New car purchase. Alex has upgraded. Now gone from the Volkswagen to the BM. Smart car, very decent. I've actually seen a lot of this from him. He was WhatsApping me over the moon with that. And again, that's from Amazon's profits. He's been able to go away, get that new car and still make good money like this. And 5,500 pound of profit in a month. This is, as he said, a slower month than expected. Future American Express putting a limit on his card, restricted his capital, so cash flow took an impact, but still was able to do those numbers. So let's move on to the next one. So we've not got a profit number here, but we've got Vicky. So second month in, only just started with us really. 2,623 pounds of sales great stuff. There we go. Josh, first shipment ready to go out on Monday. Hasib just started £326 and he'd been running for around about two weeks um, to get those numbers. And guys, this is um, a bit of a funny one. So Phil, uh, he's been with Aftermarket for years, recently started on Amazon. Me and him made a little bet. I will show you the chair that I usually sit on in the office upstairs and it's absolutely battered. Phil was sick to death of seeing it all over our socials. So we made a bet and he said to me, if I hit 10K sales this month, I am going to buy you a new chair. You can see he just like, just crossed that 10K mark. So 10,000 and 10 pounds is the number that he hit. So I have a new chair coming. So I'm going to keep you updated. And I hope Phil is a man of his word. And if you're watching this, Phil, get in the comments, let me know. But Jack, you lucky, lucky little man. How the fuck do I get this chair to Manchester? That is your problem, not mine. I'm looking forward to spending the rest of my days in the office in absolute luxury, mate. And by the way, I only sit on Herman Miller's. So... You're going to have to figure that one out as well. £3,379 of profit. £3,972 of profit. Here we go. Wilkin, best month I've had since starting in Feb. £4,566 of profit. Since he started, £206,000 of sales. 53 grand of profit made by his FBA business in what will be what? 15 months, I believe. An extra 53 grand alongside the nine to five, can't be bad. Spamford, on a month that we didn't really send anything in due to holidays and selling a dead stock, um, 3,174 pounds of sales, great stuff. We've got Alid here, 6K sales in the month. C Taylor, been with us for years now and 1,376 pounds of sales this past month. But she's even said, Slow month because she was being lazy, busy with other stuff, but ramping up. And you can see that from the chart there, that in the, the sort of the final two weeks of the month, sales picked up and we will see a great July. So we've got CB, second full month complete, onto the next. £1,373 of profit in his second month. Think about that. Second month, £100 in total on memberships with us, £50 a month. And he's done £1,373 of profit in that second month. That month alone pays for his next couple of years membership with us. Wolf of FBA, finished 2.8k over his optimistic 30k target. 
brilliant results. The funny thing is with Wolf of FBA, he actually contacted us through um, Facebook. He actually came to us originally trying to get me and my team to buy his inventory that he had access to. And we were like, no, the, there wasn't a lot of data on the products that he wanted us to buy. So he was like, no, it's not good with us. But he took a chance, started selling it on his own. He's got direct connections with wholesalers. And then look, a few months later, he's at 30, pretty much 33K in sales in one month, bonkers. Triple top G, part-time alongside a nine to five, four months in. So £4,000 of profit made in one month. And this is only his fourth month of doing Amazon FBA. What you can see here, 125% return on investment. So what that means is he only had £3,000, around about that number, to put into products. So that £3,000 of capital has resulted in him making £4,000 of profit. He's more than doubled his money. Another one here, not as happy this month, £1,647 of profit. Still good money, still good money. Very poor start to the month, but finished amazing after spending my time to get products and doing research today and yesterday, both past £300 sales, 35 orders. Great stuff from Wacko Jacko. Signed up here three days ago, £384 of profit. That was his last month. I've had a, a few conversations with Tom, very confident that we're going to get those numbers up. Um, now he's working with us full time. Here we go, JP, being VAT registered is hard. First month post VAT hitting 30K revenue, 40K next month. So he hit 30K revenue, he's VAT registered, and he did £6,000 of profit last month. Like I said, that was hard, but £6,000 of profit. JP was the maths teacher. You may have seen him on our other videos. He was a maths teacher. He's my personal best mate. Quit, doubled down on Amazon, and now he's doing numbers like that. 40K next month, and we are filming this, two weeks into July, I know that he's more than on track for that number. He's absolutely killed it this month. Hopefully gonna be looking at eight to 10K profit. I'm leaning more towards the 10K profit this month with JP. Another one growing steadily, 5,000. Best month so far, big folks on ROI has helped improve profits. 2,116 pounds of profit. Best month so far for Yorkie. He's not been with us that long. Again, I know Yorkie in real life. He works a nine to five as well. Great numbers. Um, let's keep going. So start of July. So strong here. This is actually just is today's um, big sigh. Look at that. That is the stuff we like to see. Continually reinvesting in the business and those orange bars that we all know and love increasing every time. South Wales, 320 pounds of profit. Slater, 872. Another new member, 549, 443. Guys, you get the picture. 800 pounds of profit for Matt. Sleigh Bells, 1,419. JMD, 1,185 profit. These are ridiculous numbers, guys. And as you can see, as we're scrolling through here, DGL, insane end of the month, just under 900 pounds of profit in the last three days. So let's just imagine that he, well, no, he will get to that point where he's doing 300 pound profit a day, like he has done in those last three days. When you're doing those numbers, you're going to be making an extra 100K a year for yourself. And what you need to think about is would your employer, so wherever your nine to five is, would they give you the ability to earn an extra 100 grand a year? If you said to them, right, I want my salary raised in 100 grand a year. They're probably going to tell you to do one. But having a side hustle, taking financial responsibility, taking control of your own position and actually doing something on it can lead you to that. £3,000 of profit in the month. Didn't hit 10K a month, 115K a month. There we go. 25K to date. This is the final one and it's a great one to end it on. So Sunil, Sunil um, has been in aftermarket for years, almost since the start. He actually works for us on the eBay side of the business, recently gone over to doing Amazon. Not a bad month for a side hustle. I only spend a few hours in the evenings, a couple of days a week doing this. You can achieve any goal you set with Amazon if you put the time and effort into it. Aftermarket arbitrage is king, tell your kids. That is the best sales pitch. I couldn't think of anything better. 1,000 427 pounds of profit made last month, few hours in the evenings, couple of days a week. What would you do with that money? And that's what you need to question. And that's what you need to ask yourself. Find your why. So is it, do you want a new car? Do you want to go get a BM like Alex just has? Do you want to be able to get a savings pot to go on holidays? 
home renovations? Are you saving for a mortgage? Find whatever your why is. Why do you need to be making more money? Why would making more money benefit not only your life, but those around you, your family, your loved ones? Think about it. Find your why, and that will give you the motivation to make this work. All you've got to do is do the bare minimum, put the time in, listen to us, take advantage of everything that we give you, and use our resources, and you will get on your way to adding thousands of pounds into your income every single month. Great roundup. Catch us in the next one. July's looking to be a big one, and as we get towards Q4, these numbers are going to start picking up. So if you're thinking about getting going, now is the best time to start for you because you're going to lay the foundations before Q4, Q4 being October, November, December, the busiest time for sales on Amazon. So if you lay those foundations now, you're going to be primed for Q4, meaning that you will be expecting some big, big pay packets this Christmas. Head down to the description. You will see our website. Get on that, sign up. If you've got any questions you want to call with me personally before you sign up, you want to learn a bit more, understand the process, then book a call with me. I'll run you for everything. And it is with me personally, guys. Yeah, hope everyone else smashes the rest of July. And if you're not in aftermarket, you're missing out.